Hello. Hi. I realized that I talk about Oud Wood a lot by Tom Ford, but I never kind of gave you a full review about this fragrance. In short, I really like this. This I got at the same time as Noir de Noir. Uh, it was a gift from a follower, and I actually preferred Noir de Noir more than this one. But I've been wearing this a lot lately, and I feel like this has completely grown on me because it's extremely versatile and unique in the, at the same time. And I know a lot of you here have smelled a lot of different fragrances, so to you, this is something that, you know, it might be considered overworn or basic in the fragrance community, but every person that I've had that has smelt, that have smelt things in my collection, whenever they come across this one, their eyes go wide. And they're like, whoa, I really like that. What's that fragrance? And they notice, you know, Tom Ford, so... They're like, I want to get that. That smells really good. So yes, this still has a pull on the majority of the population. And I know it's it's called Oud Wood, but does it really smell like Oud? To me, no. It does smell like, this is going to sound weird, like a very aromatic, like different kinds of woods, but not Oud. It doesn't, it doesn't smell like yeah, I don't get the oud that I get in Versala here. I don't get the oud like in Alexandria the Second. It's just like a bunch of other woods mixed up, which is why I'm just assuming here that that's why I think it doesn't really perform because it doesn't have oud. Usually, things that I've smelt that have that note in it really push over like twelve hours easily. But this fragrance, I feel like if you do when I did five sprays of this, I got around like seven. seven. I did like skin and clothes, like so seven hours, but I always overspray this one so it lasts me a long time and it doesn't choke me out. So this thing can be worn by women, can be worn by men. To me, it's completely unisex. I don't see how people are like, oh, this is very masculine, it's only masculine. Maybe on your skin, but like there are so many girls that love to wear this and I think before this actually became a part of my collection. This is just what I've noticed based on the reviews that I saw. A lot of the uh, darker complected women were like, oh yes, I use this fragrance very easily and it's just like, I love it on myself. But then the lighter complected women were like, oh no, this is very masculine, blah, blah, blah. So I don't know how that plays out on skin tones, but with me, with my skin tone, with my sisters tried this on, we have no problem wearing this. This is not something that's Overly masculine, blah, blah, blah. Does it smell amazing on a guy? Hell yeah, it does. Absolutely. But yeah, ladies, don't don't think you can't give this a shot. I mean, you can try it at Nordstrom, at Bloomingdale's. I will give this fragrance, if I had to rate it, ah, God, I have to give it like a nine or like a nine and a half because I really enjoy wearing this one and I know that I'm not the only one that would enjoy it when I wear it, when I'm around other people, they always, always, always compliment me on this fragrance right here. So it's just something that's an easy to reach, um, easy to reach scent. And it goes from maybe, is it 225, 250 for the 50 mLs, which is very, you know, which is typically what Tom Ford prices his fragrances for. So I get it, performance, that's a bit of an issue, especially if you're gonna buy at retail, but do I like it? Yeah, I do. I do like it. And to me, yes, if, if you had to ask me if it's unique, when comparing it to other designer scents, like if you kind of, yes, it's unique when you consider, like when somebody that is not into fragrances smells this. That's the reaction I've gotten. Like, oh yeah, that's, that's different. I want to get that because it's different. In the fragrance community, they might, you know, they might just think it's Tom Ford, it's a designer, therefore it's not unique. But I don't think that way. I think that this is still a unique fragrance. Um, so thanks for watching. I'm gonna post another video after this, but I love Oud Wood by Tom Ford. <sighs> Nine out of ten. I want to say ten out of ten right now just because it always makes me happy. Anyways, let me know what your scent of the day is. I am wearing Alexandria the second, but I also have a secret fragrance on my wrist right now. Can't say what it is. Can't say what it is, but I'll see you later. Okay, bye.